Home to me means solace, means a place to escape to. And so home is something I just relish, cherish. I'm Neil Patrick Harris, and this is my house. I grew up in New Mexico. My parents, Ron and Sheila, met in college, got married, are still married, had two children. Brian's my older brother. He's three years older than I am. He was a fantastic older brother to have. He and his friends would go spelunking in caves. It was kind of cool to hear that he was a bit of Indiana Jones. And considering I was the annoying, performing younger brother, he was kind to me and let me follow around on all of his adventures. And I really appreciated that. Didn't get beaten up very much, so that's a good thing. Brian has lived lots of really interesting chapters in his life. He went to law school, studied in the UK for a while. He traveled the world. He's a historian. He's a fantastic writer. Saved every letter that he's written. His sense of humor is fantastic. And so he's done a lot of stuff. He, for the last many years, has been pretty much living by himself. And when you live by yourself in a house, you don't have to worry about so much. Since then, now he has a new girlfriend named Sashin, who's amazing. And she has her own family, which is now part of his family. Brian doesn't always want me to spoil him, but I think this is one way that I can do it. Brian bought this house many years ago. It was kind of a fixer-upper. For all of the things that he has improved in the house, he's pretty much ignored this den and the backyard. The den right now, I think it's not even a practical space. There's no real furniture in it except for a weight bench. There's a lot of things stacked. It's not a hoarder, but it feels like a room that you put stuff in when you're not sure where it goes. The backyard's an interesting space because it's a big backyard, but it's neither here nor there. It just sits there with nothing going on. So I want to renovate the den and the backyard. I have a vision that Brian has never thought of and I think might blow his mind whole. House is making this renovation possible from thousands of miles away. On House, you can find everything that you need for a renovation project. You can find people, you can find products, and you can find inspiration. I went online and I looked for professionals in the Albuquerque area. I found Lisa from Samuel Design Group. I looked through Lisa's past projects and I loved her aesthetic and her reviews were stellar. I reached out and I called her on the phone. Lisa suggested we bring in her colleague Solange for the landscaping. I hopped on a plane and I am meeting them in New Mexico. Fingers crossed. I'm just excited for this opportunity for my brother to have something fresh and new and exciting. He has lived in this place for years and I just would love for it to feel like home. And I would really like my brother to have a sense of pride about this house so that he can show it off and, and feel it. proud of it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and one of the things with this den room is that the flow is a little bit strange. It was kind of the only way to get outside. And that space has now kind of become a storage room. And it just feels right. like a room that has no... No purpose. No purpose. With its proximity to the kitchen, mm -hmm. it seems that there should be a natural connection between the two rooms. Agreed, and... because there's a pocket door in there yes. right now. And that seems not effective to a kitchen moving into another room. Right. My idea is, is that we create a division between the two rooms, but something that is visually beautiful and make it feel like it's more connected rather than divided. Fantastic. Yeah. You call it then, I call it a link. The link. Because that will be the link to the outdoor that's right. as well. Well, that's super important too, because being able to do an indoor space and an outdoor space is fantastic. It's a big it's backyard, a big, big, but big it's space. relatively unusable in every way. There's not really a deck. Rock. There's just kind of a concrete slab area. Right. One idea was extending the house. You create a new room, but you also generate that contact with nature because hmm. we're trying to combine this as a wildflower, meadow, and then pollinators and eventually bees or repurposed. You said bees? Like yes. you could actually have a hive of bees? You can actually have a hive of bees. That's um, safe? That's safe, it's friendly. Really? Killer they bees. Are safe, I, you've heard of killer bees. <laughs> he has a family, you know. It's so dry, they don't want to come. That's true. So Neil, I want to show you the idea book
in the den, I think that it could become a really nice place to relax and lounge, and you can actually get some light in there. I think that is the most important, that's the key. Yeah, it is. I want to bring in a pop of blue. I like this vibe. This fabric is a cut velvet, so it's really inviting and comfortable. Oh, Brian would love that, that's some, very cool. Okay, very good, well, let's buy it. Love it, brilliant. We already have a fireplace in there, mm -hmm. and I'd like to cover up all of that ugly, smoked-up brick with some beautiful tile. Wow. In the corner of this, there's a blue throw blanket. Right. That's a great little pop of blue. Can you do something like that in the Absolutely. wall? This was an image that I added. I like that there's a little bit of foliage, nature. Very inviting. We want to bring the outdoors in. Mm. This plant in particular is a fiddly fig with great big leaves mm. and it's fantastic. I love an Eames chair. Mm. Brian has a variety of interests. He's an avid reader and he loves things that look like art but are mm. also functional. And it seems, I don't know, kind of cool and hip and something he would like. We can buy the Eames chair right now, add it to the cart. Bow. Done. So here we see a link between an interior room and an exterior room. I like the decking a lot. It's gonna be a transition, creating another room, and then the nature. That would be great. Ah, this was one that I put in here. I really well, like I the love, lights. I love those lights. Yeah. That creates some flexibility. But what I thought was cool on this was that the pergola was covered in a way because mm -hmm. in Albuquerque it gets very, very warm. And I feel like even if you were to create an outdoor space and in the summers you wouldn't really be able to use it effectively without 100 SPF sunblock. <laughs> so here we have a lounge area next to a cooking area. This is way bigger in scale than I was imagining. So yes, multiple zones in the backyard would be fantastic. Can I ask a question? Yes. I'm loving this fire element with the concrete gray square. Is that a possibility or is that too modern? Not at all. I think the scale of this one is too big for the project that we're working on. So here you see an example of a fire pit yeah. and it's smaller. Yeah and much more appropriate to what we're doing. This little white tag indicates that we can find a visual match to a product that's available on Hal's shop. You can buy any of these? Yes, and that's the one I think that would be appropriate in terms of size and the look. Cool, I love it, let's get it. Boing. Okay, what is this? This is a swing? Yes, and if you wanna see the size, Ha, huh. that's amazing. Add to cart, add to cart. Wait, we have to pay for this eventually? <laughs> eventually. Uh, <laughs> you should be more conscious of the add to cart edict. <laughs> well, Neil, so we have a concept, we have a plan. This is super exciting. I can't be here on site. I'm filming in uh, New York, but my dad has agreed to help. His name's Ron. Oh, that's wonderful. Super lovely, he's that nice. I'm so appreciative for what you guys uh, have done thus far. I can't wait. This is the den. The door that goes from the kitchen to the den hasn't worked uh, since I've seen the house. I can't repair it, I've tried. We need to create something that's beautiful. And we're doing that with an open louvered wall. Sounds good. So as you can see, there's a lot that needs to be done out here. In New Mexico, we enjoy the outdoors 10 months out of the year. That is true. Hi, Solange. Nice, nice to be Ron. here, Ron. Nice to meet you. I'm pleased to meet you, Solange. It's a pleasure. She is our landscape designer. Tell me what you have in mind. We know New Mexico, we need water, shade, and a path. Exactly. Then we have it all. I think these big trees could be a great anchor for shade. Then we're going to create an imaginary line that we say, what is the outdoor comfort living and the wild zone? And in that wild zone, we're planning a flower pollinator garden. And of course, we're gonna have water feature. I know he'll love that. Ron, we're starting demo tomorrow, so you better be ready bright and early. Let's do it, ladies. Thank you. Listening to what Lisa and Solange had to say, I've gotta say it's gonna be exciting.
Hey, Lisa. Hey, Ron. How We're are ready you to today? go. Ready to go. Got my hammer. Ready to take out that pocket door. I hate that pocket door. This is my favorite hammer. All right, have at it. All right. <laughs> There's the door. Oh, yes. Hello, ladies. Hi, Ron. It's looking a little bit different. Yes. So what do you got? So we were looking at the House app, and I'm thinking that this sectional would be really beautiful. But I would like to show you how it looks in the room. Okay. I'm going to tap on View in My Room 3D, scan the floor area. Oh, it shows the couch. Inside, yes, in it, it inside does. Inside the room. How we it are. most certainly does. How does it do that? <laughs> I don't know how it does it, but it does it. Would, yeah. you, would you like to buy that? Heck yeah. Okay. Add to cart. And that's it. And we're ready to go. Okay. I think it's time to call Neil. All right. Hi, Neil. How are you? Excellent, Lisa. This is all very, very exciting. Hey, Neil. How are you holding up, Dad? Ah, uh, pretty well. Yeah. <laughs> it's gonna it's really color. look, it's really gonna look pretty, you know. You're gonna love it. Here's the entire space. Uh, look. I've always loved that that fireplace wall was so big, and I, I can't wait to see how the new tiles will make everything even more impressive. Hi. Hey, hi, Solange. Yeah, I'm gonna take everybody to the outdoor. So. Wow. <laughs> that deck is gigantic. It's gonna be a semicircle which is oh, wow. actually going around the house. And then all there will be table and chairs. I didn't realize how big it, the space is back there. It's able to take that gigantic deck and it still feels like there's even more space all around it. So oh, yeah. It's great design. <laughs> also, we're going to have a barbecue place and we're going to have a sink and a prep table. Uh, we designed this pergola. Are you going to have any greenery that's going to start snaking up and through that? Yes, every column will have a vine right. coming up. Great. I'm going to show you some of the ornaments. Oh, wow. That was our way to bring water. Is that practical? It's ornamental and it's practical. That's um, great. On the other side of the deck, all this area will be filled by all these amazing plants. We are creating a little nursery here, but pretty soon all these plants are going to be on ground and growing. Your brother is going to become a beekeeper. Oh boy. We are creating the backdrop for that to be possible. I love this idea. I'm getting jealous of this whole thing. <laughs> <laughs> then you come often. Dave and I will come and we'll cook up a feast for everyone. We can't wait to see the finished product. I just want Brian to love it. Oh, he will. He will. I guarantee it. Hey, thank you guys so much. Stick with it, stay at it, and I'll see you guys very soon. Bye-bye. Bye, Neil. Bye, Neil. Neil absolutely loved it. It's going to look so nice. It's just going to be a total transformation. It's you. How are you? I'm fine. How are you doing? I'm great. Have you seen this whole place already? Not, not yet. No. I talked to Brian. He seems nervous. Yeah, well, I bet he is. He didn't get much sleep last Let's night. Let's go check it out. <laughs> that is this perfect. Fantastic. Yeah. I love it. Hey, ladies. Hey there. How are you? How are you? Nice you? To it's see good to see you. Nice, nice to see you. Nice to see you. Hello. 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 Welcome to New Mexico. So exciting. Yeah. Love this wall. I want to 
do this at my house. I am stunned at the transformation. Wow. It's amazing, oh, wow, isn't it? Man. It's an entirely it different environment. It is a different place. <laughs> I like that the whole thing, inside and out, doesn't have a lot of straight lines, even though it's angular. The backyard is absolutely phenomenal. It feels like you're in some sort of public park. Wait, we still have to do work, right? Yes, we yes. still have to work. Get yeah. out. Yeah, all, right. all right, let's get some work done. Yeah. Perfect. This is exactly what it looks like on housing. Turn it this way a little bit more. It needs to be parallel. There you go. Perfect. Good. Thanks for helping. Yeah. <laughs> I think we're there. I love it. I cannot Great. wait to get his reaction. I really appreciate that you guys did this for him. Oh, thank you. We're done with the last minute judging, and it's time. My heart is racing. I hope he loves it. Neil has been the most wonderful brother that you could be lucky enough to be born with. For him to give this to me, I'm just so excited. Hey, hey, how are you? I'm good. Good to see you. You're welcome. Thank you. You really don't know much of anything. No, I don't. You could have dusted, and and then I'd be thinking that's that's great. What are you feeling? Nervous. Yeah. You want to go look at it? All right, I'm ready. All right, let's go. <laughs> Whoa. I, uh, this isn't, this is some, what have you done with my old room and don't ever bring it back and leave this room here? The fireplace is all fixed. That's tile, all gray tile. Uh -huh. And then they added this super cool blue tile that's from Spain. It's crushed glass. Oh man, I, I like the way it creates a little separation. Agreed. They took out the pocket door. That's so cool. It's a partition wall, but if you're sitting in, say, the reading area, you can see through into the kitchen. And the I love that. I've never had an Ames chair. I've <laughs> always wanted to have an Ames chair. They're very classy. I was hoping that it would be nicer than it was, but I never dreamed that it could be this nice. All right, I gotta see the couch, because this is gonna be critical. Oh, man. This is fantastic. You want to check out the outside? Will my heart be able to take it? Because <laughs> I, I'm sort of dizzy right now just with taking in this room. Maybe you need a breath of fresh air. Come on. All right. You ready? Yeah. Come out this way. <laughs> I <c> <laughs> I can't believe this. I'd always pictured just having a small deck, but th this is, it's like three rooms. It's a sitting room, a dining room, and a kitchen, but it all like hooks together. It's There's expanded. shade. There's a fire pit. Proper fire pit. Watching his face, that's really something that I'll never forget. Check out this unbelievable pergola. It's not just a simple, boring, regular, square pergola. It's made of metal, so you can do your workouts. Man, it's an oasis in the desert. There's, yep. There are fountains. This cool water feature. It's so zen. Right? It's amazing. This is so beautiful. What is, the, what is that thing? This is a swing. Can you spin? Oh, yeah. Just good for a, you know, a late night after a bottle of wine or something. <laughs> Look at this. Nice. Mm. Cheers to the first of many. <laughs> Thank you so much. I can't believe this. I'm speechless. So you said that you liked bees. We can do bees here. Yep. To find out that not only do I get to have bees now, but that the whole backyard has been designed to make bees happy. It's just wonderful. I'm just blown away. I mean, there, there are so many things. It does feel like it had a lot of input from somebody who actually knew me. Um, so I, I expect that you're behind that. A little bit. Yeah, <laughs> that, means, that means a lot to me.
I couldn't be happier about how it has all turned out. So I'm thrilled that it's creating an opportunity and a space for you to start your next big chapter, whatever it may be. You deserve it. Thank you. Thank you so much for everything. We're gonna be out here a lot, and we're gonna think about you every single time we're out here. This is impetus for us to come out more often. I did. <laughs> we're gonna stay in mom and dad's backyard now? Forget it. I think mine's cooler now. Way cooler. <laughs> <laughs> hey! Huh? <laughs> oh my gosh! Hi! Oh man. Hi, honey. How are you? Good. So, do you like it? Well done. My son. Like oh, is too way sweet. too tame a word. <laughs> Here, have a seat. Have a seat. The art is really impressive. Hashtag howls. This piece is a close up of my abs. It, yeah. No, it's funny because I couldn't see it. And now that's all I can say. Yeah. Is, is your abs. Yeah, okay. and gold yeah. in between. Yeah. Solid gold. I bathe in solid gold. <laughs> hey. Hey, everybody. Hey. hey. This is Solange and Lisa, Brian. Lisa and Solange were the ones that really were here doing it all. Hi, Thank you Brian. so much. Nice to finally meet you. Almost more than anything else, I'm excited about Sashin, my girlfriend. This is something I'm really excited for her to see. That's awesome. This is amazing. Oh, look, there's a shed. I know, isn't that great? <gasps> Movie nights, you know? Under the stars. And now you can re-watch all of everything I've ever done. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, it's so fun for Early you. stuff is gonna be great. We love to watch movies. I'm very excited about movie night. I thought it would be fun to have a, like, a little bit of a cookout. Mm, that's great. Isn't it pretty? Bella, Bella. Welcome. <laughs> How are you, super sweet girls? Well, but I knew right away that the choices made were going to be effective. Looking good. Thank you. He jumped right in. We're fancy. We didn't used to be fancy, but now, now we're very fancy. <laughs> May I just make a toast? To my brother, Brian, I hope that you have countless amazing new episodes in your life. May this be the first of many. Love you, bud. Love you, too. Cheers. 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 Cheers, everyone. Cheers. Cheers. Who wants a burger? Everyone. Yeah, that's a lot. First hamburger. Job well done. Be heaven. It is be heaven. We were just talking about what kind of bees you want. We want the hairless bees. They're the best. <laughs> I think my brother's future looks better than ever. He's found a girlfriend that he cares about a lot. She's opened up his heart and now a space that he gets to share with her. Yeah, in six months, I'll be able to open my own uh, organic grocery store. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> You'll see. <laughs> I mean, he's my big brother. Cheers. So I want to make sure things go well for him. <laughs>